In court this month, Josh Duggar's attorneys accused prosecutors of hiding evidence during a struggle over discovery. As fans celebrate Josh's downfall, however, an eye-catching news story began to circulate. An apparent obituary made the rounds, claiming that Josh had died months before his jury trial is set to begin. His attorneys claim that it's entirely false, and his family is just peace. If you use social media very much, you may have noticed an uncomfortable phenomenon. Some people will just see a tweet or a headline, no matter how vague, and assume that they know what it says, and that it's true? If you're reading these words, you're clearly the sort of person who does want to know more than a 10-word headline can convey. Good. Across multiple social media platforms, users claim that former American reality TV personality Josh James Duggar died. Uncritical retweets and reposts acted like a game of telephone, with some believing that it was true. Some were sad. Some were confused. Some were downright hopeful. If you saw the news and felt a glimmer of hope, we have the grim task of quashing that optimism. According to Josh's attorney, Travis W. Story, Josh is very much alive. In fact, he says that he's spoken to Josh since being asked about it. Story told the son thanks for your concern. I have communicated with my client this afternoon since your inquiry, he shared. And, Story confirmed, there's no truth to that rumor. In case anyone is worried that there's an elaborate conspiracy theory to pretend that a dead man is still alive, Story's story fits. Multiple county coroner's offices in the area confirm not having Josh's body. Additionally, there have been no emergency calls placed by the Rubber family, as one might if someone had up and died on their watch. An inside source close to the Duggar family has also opened up on this topic. Many of the family are trying to stay away from what is written about Josh at the minute, the insider shared. The source added that they are discouraged especially from looking at Twitter comments since his arrest. And despite public opinion of him right now, the insider explained. The source expressed that it's very upsetting to hear keyboard warriors are making up these rumors. The source concluded in causing more stress for them at such an awful time. There are many reasons, some better than others, for resenting that false stories would circulate about Josh. Maybe misleading tales of his death made someone feel sad for his family. Maybe it made them feel hopeful. Or maybe every false rumor that gets claimed as true gives Duggar apologists ammunition to claim that even genuine information is fake. The sad fact is that there are some who follow the Duggar family, not like tracking the aftermath of a storm, but out of genuine admiration. Jim Bob and Michelle covering up for Josh, or even Josh's crimes confessed and alleged alike are all things that some find excusable. So when they hear any wild rumor reported as fact, and then debunked, they use it to cast false doubt on true stories.